I'm so happy to send all those who will march against Monsanto on 21st a loving message of solidarity from Navdhania's farm with these beautiful jackfruits behind me. The land gives us so much of abundance, so much diversity. Our creativity, our knowledge, the knowledge of our ancestors, that is the basis of the future of our food. And we're going to devote our lives to reclaiming our seeds and our knowledge, our agriculture, our soil, our water. That's why we walk march against Monsanto. And this year, the march is particularly significant. It's significant because across the world, people are waking up to the lies Monsanto spoke about glyphosate and cancer. In India, finally, the government is waking up to the fact that Monsanto roiled, lied about royalties. It didn't have the right to collect royalties, and it did, and it pushed our farmers to suicides. Most of the 300,000 farmer suicides are in the BT cotton area. 95% cotton is now BT cotton. India, the land of cotton, land where cotton was the fiber of freedom, where Gandhi pulled out the spinning wheel, today has made cotton a curse, but we are reclaiming the fiber of freedom with organic cotton, and organic farmers are earning 10 times more. This year, whether it is the intellectual property and the patents and seed, the false claims to royalty in Argentina, where now Monsanto is threatening they're going to withdraw, they take knowledge of toxics, just as they threatened in India. Well, it's not a threat, Mr. Monsanto. Take your toxics with you. And even if you become Monsanto plus buyer or Monsanto or anything else, we are going to make the world free of your toxic lies, your toxic profits, your toxic science, your toxic power. We are holding a trial of Monsanto and whatever form it might mutate into. This World Food Day the citizens of the world will tell Monsanto what they think of it, as we would tell them now during the march. And we will hold people's assemblies everywhere where we can to think of how we should live with the earth, to think of agroecology as the true solution, to think of open source liberated seeds as the foundation of our food freedom. Together, with our love, with our solidarity, we are more powerful People have power. Toxic lies don't. That's what we have to show in our work in the next few years. With love to all of you, march strong.